All these questions are, have you thought about dating each other? Are you guys dating? What do y'all ever date? What do y'all find attractive about each other? <laughs> Hey guys, it's Amanda. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe and turn on my post notifications so that you don't miss an upload. Mm -hmm. Today I have a special guest. The Julian Barboza. The Julian Barboza. Finally back. He's back from tour, guys. Yeah, He's straight back. off a tour. Back in LA for a couple days. And then hopefully I move out here. Hopefully. So we're gonna be doing a mukbang today. I had you guys ask us questions on Instagram and we got sushi. It looks good. Playing drums over there? Like, yeah. what's going on? Anyway, I don't know. We got some sushi, and we're just gonna eat it and talk. Basically. All right, but before we um, go, I'm not gonna be using these to eat. He's weird. I'm just gonna use my fingers, all right? Hopefully nobody gets mad. That's kind of disgusting. Well, okay, I'm gonna Do try. Do you use soy, um, soy sauce? No. Okay, you just eat sushi all wrong, huh? Bro, what? <laughs> no soy all right, sauce, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. no chopsticks. It, look, okay, just to be fair, it already has soy <gasps> sauce on it. Yeah, that's probably why Oopsies. I don't. I don't use. Oh wait, yours has more to it though. Yeah, look, it just fell apart. That's why I don't have them. Amanda, what did you do? I'm using it as a dish. Mmm. To dip it. Are you on some different on. stuff? Hold on, don't eat it all. <laughs> He's gonna be dumb. Yeah, that's I'm... why we should have got like other things. I'm hungry. I just <laughs> needed one in my body, you know. Just to, <laughs> this like... is gonna be like a silent. <laughs> ASMR. We're not gonna nah, speak. Nah, it's because I'm real life gonna... hungry. Yeah. I just needed one in my body, just so I'm not starving. Yeah, because we just filmed for Julian's channel and it took about three and a half hours to actually get the video filmed mm -hmm. because somebody, um... It was an interesting video. You guys should go watch yeah, it. Yeah, no, you guys shouldn't go watch it. No, you guys no, should. Anxiety. It's a banger video. Yeah, I probably should have got another one. Describe what living slash being in LA feels like. Okay. Well, I don't live here. Amanda so does. Okay, so we can answer it from different perspectives. All right, bet. Wait, when did you first move here? Mm. I moved here in March, so it's been like five months. Oh, so I lived here before you. Almost half a year. I think living in LA, it's like a lot to adjust to, and I feel like the whole time I've lived here, I've had a lot of visitors, so it's hard to tell exactly what life is gonna be like alone for like a long time. I don't know. Oh, she's but, you know? alone. But I will say that you have to kind of be very like hard on, or not hard on yourself, but like you have to set a lot of like, boundaries you gotta be yourself. disciplined yeah you have to be disciplined because there's always something to do every single night you get hit with something that's like sounds really fun and it's like how do i say no to like something like that but you have to learn how to say no like people don't sleep here i swear they don't sleep they don't work they don't do anything but go <laughs> every night it's so confusing yeah. well, i say living in la it's very fast paced but when i when i was here for a month every day i thought it was the next day so like i would be so confused like i would think it was tuesday and it was monday and like forget track of time you usually go to sleep at like five o'clock mm -hmm. in the morning for me whenever i lived here i'd forget to eat sometimes yeah, i'd just be amazing. going you just wake up somebody texts you like yo pull, pull up or come but recently i've been saying no to a lot which is hard but i have been because i need to because i think you went hard for a whole month yeah so now i'm at a show yeah now i'm relaxing it's fun i love living here you know some tea about a very well-known person in LA. Don't have to say what and who. Yeah. <laughs> Next. Amanda knows everyone in LA, guys. No, I don't. Well, she doesn't know them, but she's met everyone. She knows a lot of people, guys. A lot of people. Mm-hmm. But I will admit, Amanda's not like normal LA girls, right? Thanks. I don't know what that means. Is that a compliment? <laughs> yes. But I, I was told Amanda too that she's gonna change. Yeah. So far, she hasn't. Don't not yet. I'm not, I'm not gonna change. Not yet. You know I'm not gonna change. They know I'm not gonna change. Everyone knows I'm not gonna change. Somebody wrote, are you each other's types? And then said, describe each other's types. <laughs> um, I don't have a type, to be honest. You don't have a type? I don't think I really do. All right, what is your preference? No, I, I feel like I like people based off of like, who they are. Who they are? Like who they are. No, 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 like who they are um, as a person. No, 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 like, okay. let me finish. Who they are as a person, like, so like you're personality, saying looks don't matter. Personality, and then like the vibe, like if we have a connection or not. All right, well, I'm gonna tell you right now that it's cat, bro. Not uh, I swear. Bro, looks definitely matter. Mm -hmm. Looks definitely matter, but I think for Amanda, yeah, you can get away with them. Vibe and what'd you say, personality? I don't know. A lot of the guys that I've liked look look different. That's why. Actually, I, say I don't that. think I've seen them. You haven't shown me. I've told you. Yeah, you told me, but I haven't seen them. Like a picture. You know who some of them are, though. Oh. What? Okay, what you just described does not match any of the guys that you told me. <laughs> that does not describe no. it at all. How? 
How? Well, I've changed since then because I got really hurt <laughs> by those little fucks. Whatever. Amanda yeah. likes cool dudes. We'll say that. Yeah. Really cool dudes. What? <laughs> you're such a dick. Yeah, they're so cool. Oh my god. Awesome. Anyway, I don't know what your type is. My type? Lips. Mandatory. I need a girl that's confident. Can't have no insecure. But to be honest, yeah, those are just the main things. Lips, nice hair, confident. Bro, all these questions are, have you thought about dating each other? Are you guys dating? What do y'all ever date? What do y'all find attractive about each other? <laughs> guys, I'm trying to have a civil conversation here. I don't want to be flirting on camera or any of that. How to deal with a breakup. Amanda knows. Mm -hmm. I personally cannot tell you. I have never done, I've never dealt with that. I think that the number one thing is that you cannot be in communication with them if you're trying to get over them. Out of sight. Out of, out mind. of mind. It's actually so true. Like if you're talking to someone every day still and seeing them, you're not gonna like fully get over them. All right, favorite and worst zodiac sign. My favorite is Scorpio because I am one. My least favorite, uh, low key, it might have to be a Sagittarius. That's my rising sign, so that kind of is fucked up. I don't know what that means. So your rising sign is like your personality and how you come off to others. You like, believe in zodiac signs? I know that I don't like such. <laughs> no, I don't know actually. Um, what's yours? My favorite? I don't have a favorite. I guess myself. Yeah, myself. Mm -hmm. Gemini. He's a Gemini. Yeah. Scary. And then... <laughs> so scary. <laughs> nah, bro. We're the best. And then the, my least favorite? All of them. Oh, okay. They're not Gemini's. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. I don't really have a least favorite. You don't know? Yeah, I don't really like pay attention to it that much. Like somebody that I dislike and then like, oh, that's their zodiac sign. I don't like those anymore. You know? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> it depends on the person. That's true. Opinions on friends with benefits. Do you have any? Hmm? Do you have any? Like friends with benefits? Do you think that works? No? Do you? No. Have you ever Actually, done? yeah, it does work. I have. I, yeah, it works. Mm -hmm. Until they get a boyfriend. Then it's like, dang it, I gotta find a new one. <laughs> um, I've done it, I think. You think? No, I have. And does it work? Did you uh, catch feelings? No? Like, it was just weird. I don't, I think that the sex wasn't good enough to mm. be like friends with benefits. And then he liked me and I didn't like him. First impression <laughs> of each other. We've answered this. Um, oh, we did? On the other video? Not in my own. But First I think it's, it's good now. Hmm? I think it's good now to answer it. Like, we know each other more. Yeah, but like our first impression doesn't change. Okay, first impression till now, like what is the... Oh, like the difference? Yes, cool. that's a good... Uh, you answer first. I, I need nah, more time. Nah, I, I, I can answer first. All right. Yeah, I need more time. Actually, we were talking about this yesterday, bro. When I saw Amanda off of her Instagram, bro, I think she, she just looks like a bitch. Like she looks mean. Like, and she looks taller, right? Mm -hmm. So that was like my first, first impression. And then when I saw her, I was like, oh, Amanda's short. And she's not mean. And what else? First impression, I'm trying to remember. It was in the lobby with her friend, my friends. And uh, I was like, yo, this girl lives by herself in a nice crib. Dang, she's she's uh, she's successful. And you were cool. That's about it. I think we I think we got along, right? Mm -hmm. We had good conversations. Mm -hmm. But now my first impression was like, yo, she looks the same as she looks like on Instagram. Um, she's not a bitch. <laughs> she's short. And I thought she was cool. You know what I'm saying? She had good vibes, you know? She loves talking about vibes and all this rocks and vibey artwork. And she, yeah, you can tell a lot by her house. Um, and then till now, wait, hold on. Let me tell you okay. till now. Okay. Till now, bro, one, the number one thing about Amanda that like just is her <laughs> face. Facial expressions, bro. <laughs> like, she just has a face for every single, like, mood, every single feeling, like, and it just, like, it just hurts my brain sometimes. <laughs> I make him very mad. Bro, yes, because she asked me a question and she just makes, like, the, like, <laughs> like, meanest face, not mean, but it's just, like, face that makes you feel like, bro, what? Like, <laughs> okay, like, it's hard to explain. Just, like, whenever you're watching her videos, watch her facial expressions and you'll see. I don't know if I do it as much on camera, like, it's more in the moment of like my reaction, like yeah, yeah. Like, that exact face. Like if you well, say if you say, if you say something and and Amanda just like she'll make like a weird face, like you look dumb or something. I'm like, did I say something bad? Like, like, <laughs> that doesn't help your overthinking. <laughs> exactly, I'm it does sorry. not. It really I'm does sorry. not. I don't mean it like that though. It's kind of funny to me. Like I'm kind of just like, yeah. huh? that was a long first impression. My first impression of Julian. When he followed me on Instagram, I thought um, that he looked like a little boy. It's like a little TikTok boy. Right. And then, but I followed him back. I was like, oh, whatever. Kind of forgot. Kind of forgot. 
still got the Because he comments on my picture, I think. So I was like, oh, okay, but. So then. That's game right there. So then bro. I forgot he existed. <laughs> I thought I really just thought Amanda was another LA girl. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, I'll, I you know, didn't live in LA when you okay, called bro, me. I, I, I just thought you was in LA, so I was like, okay. you know what? I'll DM her later. Yeah, then I forgot he existed because I follow a lot of people on Instagram, so like, you know, I just kind of forgot. And then he came to my apartment because my friend invited him and his friends over, mm -hmm. and she was like, "This is who I invited." And I was like, "Oh shit!" I actually follow him on Instagram. Didn't even. Yeah. Realize, and then they came. I didn't really think. Like I don't. I don't really have too many thoughts going. She to my meets brain. so many people, so just like, Shut oh, up. it's another person. <laughs> no, you know no, what no, 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 no. It just like wasn't. I don't know. It wasn't a setting where I was like really thinking, like super into it. And then we all hung out for a while that night, and it was just fun. Like I don't know. I liked talking to you, and I thought that you were cool. But what's funny is that like my two friends liked Amanda, so like the whole time they were like trying to like get at Amanda, so like. She was like distracted by Why them. Why are you they closing them? Bruh, it's facts. Both okay. of them like you. And they were like... Three of them. Well, actually, three <laughs> of them. And they are all entertaining Amanda, you know what I'm saying? Doing what they do, trying to get her attention. Like. So I had fun because I was being entertained. <clears throat> yeah, my little boys. So nah. my first impression of you was that you were cool. And I was like, oh, he's not like a child. And you look better in person than you do. That's true. Yeah. I feel like most boys look better in person. And then now, yeah, I think the same. You're cool and shit. <laughs> <laughs> what? Now? What? I I still think you're cool. No, now I know him well. No, it's something about Julian. He gets really fucking mad really easily, and it's kind of scary. Like, I can tell. Like, he just, like, switches. I just don't even want to talk to him. I just want to like go in the other room and like leave him alone because he's scary. I feel like he's gonna like fucking yell at me, and I don't like being yelled at. I'll cry, so I just leave. But I don't even yell at you. But <laughs> half know. the time it's like, I know. bro, the number one thing that gets me mad about Amanda is I like tell her something like, can he you give me the pillow? Very low. Bro, he no, there's no low. in between, bro. It's either can you give me the pillow or it's can you give me the pillow, Amanda? Like and. She just cannot hear, bro. Even on like when I FaceTime her, <laughs> what would you say? FaceTime so is different because it goes in and out. E it's the same thing in real I know. life and because on FaceTime. I what? think that huh? I think that when I'm on my phone, I don't listen. You have ADHD or what? I think I'm. <laughs> you don't listen like you're on the phone. What do you mean? <laughs> like when I'm on my phone. Oh, so you're on, when like, I'm sitting next to you and I'm on my like on my phone looking at it and then you say something, I'll hear you say it, but I won't hear what you said. Mm -hmm. So I'll be like, hmm. So you're just not paying attention. I'll start paying attention. Mm, all right, all right. Yeah, you know, that's the only reason why I get kind of frustrated because Amanda just like, literally, I, if we counted the time she goes like, huh, what'd you say? Like, you say that like, it's just annoying, you know? So I'm annoying. So that makes me mad. No, you're not annoying. You're not listening. I'm so sorry. Anyway, what's your favorite memory you've had in LA? My favorite memory I had in LA, favorite? I had more fun in LA when I first moved here because I didn't know anything. So like everything you're like super new to and everything's fresh. Um, probably Halloween. Halloween was, and Halloween's coming so around again. I'm so excited for Halloween. Um, Halloween in LA is pretty fun. Uh, we went to like here. six different parties and like we were like locked in our house like last year because of quarantine and everything. And then just like finally getting out and like going to parties and just seeing like people for the first time. and. Really living the LA experience. That was like my favorite memory. And then obviously living in my old house, like the old content house. Mm -hmm. Just like living with a bunch of people. I think that's the favorite thing, just living with people. The old yay house. But also being a guy in LA and being a girl in LA is two different things. Like, I'm trying to think. I feel like if you're a pretty girl in LA, you kind of get whatever you want. I think that my favorite memory I think it was going to David Dobrik's birthday party, not gonna lie. <laughs> exactly my point, Listen, right? like, it was... You're a pretty girl, you get whatever you want. <laughs> it wasn't even like, because it was him, like, obviously I thought that that was cool, like, I've watched David's videos for a long time, and I don't even know, like, how I got invited. Like, I just knew someone that's friends with him, so, like, I got invited, and there weren't even a lot of people there, so it was just cool. Just because you're pretty, that's it. It was honestly just, like, a fun party. Like, he had activities, like, he, mm. like, knows how to throw a party. Like, there was food going in and out the entire time, like, I don't know, it was, it was just really fun. Like, open bar. No, yeah, it sounds fun. I it's mean, not just, like, a normal party. I think that's the thing, like, yeah. there's parties, like, they all have the same stuff. Yeah. Like, just... Most famous person you've slept with? Most famous yeah. person I slept with? Mmm. I think right. she had, like... Two mil on TikTok, yeah. two mil plus, something like that. I mean, if you consider like famous. Mm -hmm. You? 
I think he had like 10 mil on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> I think. It's yeah, really there's like a hint. 10 mil on Instagram. Isn't that too many? Go find him. I'm just kidding. <laughs> this question is from a person called Money. Money. <laughs> what do you say? Was there an initial attraction to one another before coming besties for life? Alright, first of all. <laughs> Besties for life. We never gave each other that yeah. title. <laughs> I don't know where you got that title from. No, I don't like that title. <laughs> Second, was there initial attraction? No, bro. There was. <laughs> I don't mean it like that, but I'm just saying, like, I didn't see, like, I did not, like. I wasn't like my. No, no, hold up, no, hold up. I'm not saying. It's just like, bro, all my friends liked her, and I wasn't like that, you know what I'm saying? Like, they was like, oh my god, Amanda's so pretty. Like, like, and she was, like, feeding them, you know what I'm saying? Like, Making each of them like think they like had a chance. No, I did not. Yes, you did. How? Yes, you I was did. Being nice, bro. You definitely did. How? It went from I don't even want to say. What? It went from like <laughs> like I think you were <laughs> a lot. I was just being nice. You were talking <laughs> a lot, and then you went to like and then I was not talking like that. And then you gave like you know an extra day. So it's like yo, I got it, bro. Amanda's a little player, guys. If y'all don't know. No, I'm not. I think I'm a player. I'm a fuck boy. This is a star right here. How? You get all the guys. All right, basically all the rest of the questions are asking if we will date. Um, leave us alone. Yeah, leave me alone, guys. <laughs> leave us alone. That is a terrible question to ask somebody. Yeah, and man. And never ask you, it again. Yeah, don't be asking them anymore. Can you try this? No. For the video? For it looks like shit. Just try it. Just like try it actually looks No, it's actually good. It's bro. actually good. Close your eyes then, come. All right, but if I spit it out, you can't get mad. Okay. What the bro, fuck? Bro, why is it like squishy? Eat it. Eat it, you didn't why even Why is it squishy, chance. bro? It's- You have it's... to taste it. Okay. Why can't you put the whole fucking thing in your mouth? Mm-mm. You don't like it? Bro, why is it like that? The texture. Yeah, the texture I can't do. It's like eating like- I like it, I'm gonna eat the rest. That's raw fish? Mm-mm. It's tuna, right? Mm-hmm. Fish. Yeah. Raw. Mm -hmm. That's disgusting. You try to make me eat raw fish. I mean, I don't even like sushi, only if it's cooked. Okay, this is a California roll. Yes, Sorry. you are. Nope. Yeah, you are. Why in, in you need, sea okay, sauce? Okay, okay. I mean, not sea sauce, okay. soy sauce. This is good. It adds more flavor. It's salty as hell. Yeah. Okay. What is this? Crab and right. avocado. Right. Is it cooked? Yeah. yeah. All of it? <laughs> <laughs> just a bite. Like, I don't know what you wanted. I thought you just wanted a bite like the other one. Mm. That legit has no flavor. That's why I put the fucking soy sauce. Why you put soy sauce? Okay, but you gotta get a roll that actually you can taste. You know like this crunchy roll? Why do you think it's done already? I should have gone on the. Why do you think it's done? The fire Because it was smack. Alright, whatever. We're done. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't like that? Okay. okay We're done with the video. Bye. So aggressive. We're done. We're done, guys. <laughs> this video is over. You're lucky it's even out. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so fucking tired. Now, guys, we kind of ran out of food, and low key, I'm still hungry. Should we go get more food? All right, we're gonna go. Thank you guys so much for watching. Go subscribe to Julian. Oh yeah, the Julian Barboza. Go the watch our video. Julian Barboza. Don't. Spicy truth or dare? Don't go watch. It. Banger. Don't watch. Go watch it. It's lit. I promise you. <laughs> okay. Bye. <laughs>